I'm Susan Friedman from Siena, and I'm here at the Metro Ethernet Forum, and I'm talking with Abel Tong from the Blue Planet Division. Hi, Abel. How are you? Great. I'm doing great, Susan. Thanks. So life cycle orchestration is a really big theme at this show. Can you tell me about life cycle orchestration? Well, life cycle orchestration is about creating a network, a network that has the ubiquity of the Internet. In other words, it's available everywhere combined with the quality and uh, assurance of carrier ethernet. So a high performance, secure network that's available everywhere. And life cycle orchestration is the ability to create, fulfill, and assure that network. Oh, so what are the, the trends? What, what can we see going forward with that? Well, what we're seeing today is that there are a lot of vendors, including Sienna and with Blue Planet, who are creating the tools that are necessary to create this dynamic and on-demand network that can actually be made available everywhere. Well, another big theme here at the show is openness. So how does openness relate to Blue Planet? Great question. So with openness, one of the things we think about in tech is when we think about openness, we think about Linux. Linux is probably the most commonly and, and most successful open source project that there is. And if we look at Linux, it's being applied everywhere across our industry. And what we like to do with uh, orchestration is embody some of the same characteristics that we see with Linux. In other words, Linux provides a foundation for building applications. And we'd like to create an open orchestration environment where we also provide a foundation for orchestrating and automating network services. Now what we do with Blue Planet in terms of openness is we've created an open ecosystem that allows you to bring in new resources into Blue Planet and that methodology is open as well as an open methodology around how you create services with these new resources that you've brought in. So now you can bring in physical resources like routers and switches, virtual resources like virtual firewalls or virtual load balancers or network optimization combine that with cloud to create services that include all of these elements, the wide area network, the virtualization environment, and the cloud. Speaking of an open ecosystem, I can see um, here at the show that Blue Planet and Sienna are participating in a proof of concept with CenturyLink. Can you tell me a little bit more about that proof of concept? Yeah, the proof of concept is actually really exciting. It starts with some work that's being done uh, led by CenturyLink, but being done at the MEF, uh, providing open APIs for configuring network and for also uh, extracting performance data from networks. So we've created a proof of concept that includes Blue Planet that leverages the open APIs, talking to the devices underneath, a network that consists of Sienna equipment and RAD equipment. And so we use these open APIs to create a service end-to-end -end across multi-vendors equipment and then use the APIs to extract the performance data to uh, validate that the service is actually up and running and performing as desired. So this is real world stuff. Real world stuff that will be deployed in the network soon. Well, that's fantastic, and it's great to hear the collaboration amongst all the players in the industry. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to talk with me today. Well, thank you.